And now we have Ana on the deck, so we gotta be a little careful here. I don't have Dumb Banner, but I can get Dumb Banner off of AA off in the Talus. Hands reasonable. The only problem is, eh, we've, we've found ways to beat them before, but few and far between. Northern Realms, I know, right? Hurts. On a deep and personal level, it hurts me. That's deep. Yeah, we're trying it. It's actually been alright. We've got a lot of cheeky wins. I hate the card. It hurts my soul so much. <clears throat> now it's like, oh, you played two cards apiece. You're down 16 points. Let's increase those odds, I see. See, there's not kindness in your heart. That's right, actually. Ana feels very good here. Playing on back row, so Boltus can buff before Ana on front. Yep, always swarm back row. I swarm front row, back row. Well, it depends, depends. Free gets on back row, Boltus on front row. Yeah, or Neuromancy or Heat Wave or something like that. Yeah, that's what we're talking about, baby. That's what we're talking about. That's what I like to see. Okay. You have to win here, or else you lose the game immediately. Oh, do I get to win this far up? Oh, that feels nice. Uh, might as well just pass, right? That was devastating. Close that point gap in no time at all. Got him. And we get to set up Maxi. Okay, get some Morgan Peller. Set up Maxi. How lovely. Green Weave on the bottom is a problem. Same with Kedwin Knight. Yurin's pretty bad, too. Uh, I mean... I want, Triss I want, Queen Miva I think is what we need to win this, so I am going to mulligan the Kedwin Knight to the bottom, push it to the bottom, reshuffle that deck. Bolt is so good on sticks, I know, right? Yep. When you put your end just now, Jams Gams. It's really bad, we've seen a lot of Lippy players, so it's bad against Lippy. But it does answer a lot of the stuff I can't answer. Which is the other Swarmish decks that go really tall. Maxi is good. Maxi is bay. Maxi is fantastic. She's basically resilience on a card. It's so good. Why would you not want to play Maxi in a deck? Maxi is one of the most played gold cards in Gwent currently because she's so good. Maxi is incredible, Miss J. Maxi is one of the best cards in the game, full stop, period. There's a reason people play her. She's insane. Maxi is incredible. Literally, we gain carryover by playing Maxi there, by shuffling our deck. We gain carryover. Look how good these draws are, except you. Uh, honestly, Yurin is probably worse than the other cards here, so I'll put Yurin back. You are going to be... You're the worst, I think. No, we'll put you back. Yeah, there we go. If you say so, say so. I know so. Got that big brain on it. If you run COC and heat wave, I lose the game, but that is okay. It's just a bit of a shame as it hurts me so. Why can't you just let me go? I want to do this because if they have COC, it's not a 50 50. I can't let Queen Me die or lose the game. So, as a result, we are going to take some intelligent gambles. I can do a great deal more for you. Like Fine. Uh, so, I don't want to do this, John. I mean, I can do poor infantry and then do smoke volunteers later on. 
Yeah, I think you do this. Go. Maxi commands. I don't know. I thought Maxi had two eyes for any her commands because she has two eyes in her name or two ones. I could be wrong though. There you go. Got you guys covered. Those are near Mancy, right? No heat wave. Okay, so we're good. We're in the clear. We can just play out our cards. Yeah, I'll take the infantry in back row, please. Pardon me. Coming through. Fire. That's right. That's right. Welcome to my house. If boost counters two, yeah, two of the OP. Three is, is good. It's fine. It's not great, but it's fine enough to play. Uh, like, the, you want to be really careful because you have to remember she's casting a Bone Talisman. Bone Talisman is a seven provision card and it's very, 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 very strong at that. So you want to be a little cautious of this card. Because people are like, oh, give her this or that. Like, no. Because you just play her shield wall. She's very hard to deal with. If you don't have a lock or a poison immediately. Right? You see them immediately pinging what they can. They're like, gotta, we've got to stop this. Can't be what's happening. And I'm like, hello there. Actually, <laughs> this deck works really well. This is so stupid. Games, games. Katie, it's good to see you here. Yeah, our Meave is such a powerful effect. It's very dangerous. Right now, she actually feels surprisingly good. And I will say, I've come to quite like the whenever this unit receives a boost, gain one armor. Feels pretty good. Uh, but it, she's a very dangerous card. I think we're going to score quickly and Gwent. Playing a couple months, I'm like, nowhere. Well, I had a lot of the cards, and I play, and I play pretty well. So, like, I play in Clues Beta and give me pretty much every card. Yeah, Soldier Keyword's so welcome. You're not kidding. There's a real argument to put Prince on Sayus out there, actually. Love to see you playing new decks, Arcadius. You gotta do it, right? And that's also my favorite part of the game, too. But I feel that. That's what I thought! Didn't want the third me, Brock. So we go four, three bone talismans, four ones in our hand. Four bone talismans in one round. GG. I don't think any pillar here. It's because we're going first. If we're going second. Oh, done banners are in hand. They don't want that. I mean, do you just smack Foltus and then pop a Crystal Skull and say, you have an answer, or do you die here? Let's do that. <laughs> don't say it's Geralt, Burling Oil. Yeah, I mean, the, I'm, the card I'm most afraid of is Geralt. I don't, and I'll say yes, those two other ones on my mind, Dana. Bowling Oil is like, I can brute force it. So that's actually really good for us. So that means they don't have an adept, they need an adept. And what that also means is, uh, um, they, da, 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 da. if they need a tutor or a lock, they won't have time. Griffin Witcher? I hope you don't regret your life decisions. For honor. Damn. I don't mind the deck, but I've got everything of best score I tell deck, but I either always draw the wrong cards and my opponent has the exact counter. It does feel like that sometimes. Sometimes you just have to switch decks. I mean, I feel that pain. Might as well keep the one, I think. So, uh, you got a Geralt? Or a Prince on Sayas? Yep, okay, you got the Geralt. Fine. Which is fine. You just pivot focus. Hold it right, yep. Get out of blowing oil range. Next. We are finding ourselves on a little bit of problem. I, wanna, I won't deny that. We do want Sayas to bail us here. And we have new talents. 
Let's see. Does your version of you're an Igni my uh, Witcher deck? I mean, I've, well, I technically got it from Michelle, but yeah, that's how I like Witchers personally. So is it? Oh, is it your version? No, not many people running my way. But no, man, hang in there, bud. Maybe you should try a different deck. Unless you, I mean, if you have only Scoria Tell cards, though, you can try Elf, Elf traps. Uh, I don't know. There's a lot of flavors you can go, so to speak. Dark clouds gather over to Yay. Take the uh. Yeah, I'll take the infantry here. I do need to make sure I win this round. We may have a good amount of points out right now. One, two, three. So it's this, Triss, Bone Talisman. Hope it's enough. Hey, we got a new family member. Our Optiganana. Uh, Optiganana. I hope that's right. Optiganana. Welcome to the Blade Dog family. I'm so glad you could join us here today as we embark on a wondrous adventure to try out every single candy store in this city. Let's eat all the candy. It's going to be great. Welcome aboard. Go and get in the chat. Meet the people. Say hello to me. I'll say hello to you. I stream six days a week, eight hours per day. Sunday's the day off. I'm around a lot, so come hang out. YouTube, Discord, super awesome. Uh, if you like this, you'll love those. And also Twitter and Reddit if you want to be a bit more experimental. Welcome aboard. Welcome aboard. I'm so glad you're here. I haven't really committed much. I'm going to commit Triss instead. Triss. Hit the bone talisman. Let's see. See your friend. Oh, jo or Gobble G is heading out. Gobble G, take care, my friend. Take care. And oh, we got another new family member. Take care, Gobble G. Hope to see you tomorrow. But Mark Wills. Mark Wills. Welcome to the Blain Dog family. I'm so glad you could join us here today as we contemplate weather. Uh, what or contemplate whether a California rule uh, roll is the best or worst type of sushi, which is really mocky, but you know what I mean. Welcome aboard. Go and get in the chat, meet the people, say hello to me, I'll say hello to you. I stream six days a week, eight hours per day, Sunday's a day off. I'm around a lot, coming out. Welcome aboard. If you like this, you're going to love YouTube and Discord. You might like Twitter and Reddit, which are up and coming, but definitely check out the YouTube Discord at minimum, and welcome to the family. This is feeling like it's getting out of my control really fast. I think I'm just gonna pass here. I think we lost this round. Komodo Dragons, welcome, welcome. How's it going, my friend? Like, good to see you here. What did I say to Jams Gams? John, stop chilling. John told me to stop drinking water. Good. Oh, man. That was a lot going on there. I hope I didn't miss anyone. We are closer to the 100,000 follower mark. We got a long way to go, obviously. Hands is very, very, very good. Thinking Mulligan Peller, though. That hurt. I want to, like, Peller's a good throwaway. I think our throwaway then will be Ana instead. Jerk. Okay. Are we doing this? Can I, come down now? I think so. And <laughs> All right, I'll go for the plus. John, what the deck? What do you think? Oh, I didn't click it. Sorry, I'm checking it now. I was gonna give you uh, decoy in this list. Ah, uh, nah, I don't think you want decoy in this list. I think decoy is only good if you're giving up very few points and getting a lot in return. I don't think it's. It, Good enough these days to lose points on board for an effect later on without great reasoning. Yeah, we're gonna crush them. They're gonna hate us by the end of this. It's gonna be great. A witcher with no honor is no brother of mine. Was Donna? Don't even need the buffer to be honest. Trog, Palabor, Bloody Baron, Sabrina's. I don't like Sabrina's Inferno as a general rule. Also, it would kill your poor infantry, like the left and right flanks. So I don't think it's very good. Uh, that stands out to me as a problem yeah, card. Like, Rest is fine. I live to see it. I think Philippa is better in Falibor if you can fit it in, though. I mean, at this point, you can just play this and be fine. Uh, because in your deck, uh, let's see here. Uh, Philippa can be turned into a Reverend, and of course, Falibor can't. Even have more control over Falibor. 
Uh, rest looks fine, though. Not sold in the siege infantry, though. Or, no, sorry, siege light. I'm not sure you need that. But overall, missed the point. What did I miss the point of? Sorry, friend. I'll play back row. I don't know if it's Yuridin or what the last card is, but by playing back row here, I know Geralt of Rivia is out. Okay. And if I... Leader guarantees. Okay, I got Drog, and then what do you want me to do? Let's get this over with. Alright, let's try this again. Ah. Sabrina's. Okay, you're trying to just make a big Erlen finisher? Go for it. I don't think I think Sabrina's is weird, man. That's my only complaint in your deck. But go for it. That was a great Yarden. Ah, won't deny that. Sure. Not without good reason. So we play you and we get one proc off. There's the boiling oil I was anticipating. I guess I could have been put just armored that. It made no sense not. But now we get to the really mean stuff. Yeah, that's right! Another victim! Hand's insane. I'm just gonna keep. Don't want to mulligan urine because I can't find it again if we do, and we need it for this win. Alright, we need, need to win this round, so I'm just gonna go for the easy play here. Go like that. Sun Banner, Foltis, give Foltis the Crystal Skull, and watch them cry. Just cry over and over and over. Huh. Mill, maybe? Is this actually gonna be Mill? I'm gonna go for now. Enjoy the Gwenning Nomad. Take care. Hope to see you tomorrow, if not sometime soon. Take care, my good friend. Things were hanging out indeed. It was fun. I thought it was just be cloggers. Yeah, right? It's yeah, it's cloggers. Okay. Open this gate, kneel before your king, I am excited to see how I get out of this one, Punk. Yes. Alright. Damn it. Basically says, do you have tall removal? No, then this is going to be a miserable experience for you. Yeah, there we go. That's what I'm talking about, guys. So now we just chill out, right? That's, oh, they make volunteers on the bottom of my deck. Darn it, it's a bad interaction. I gotta be really careful, Foltis. Foltis is weird. Oops. Hell. Fired volunteer. Lols. <laughs> Tomorrow shall bring a better day, hopefully. Indeed. Tomorrow's, I mean, it's been a good day. I mean, I need to win this round if I want to win the game, so let's just spend one here. Is the healthier member of Nilfgaard's not good? I mean, it's just a healthier meta. I think you can full stop it there. Don't know. I literally don't know. If I just pass here, I don't think you can catch me in two cards. Well, I guess you could do two and two cards. I don't, I don't know if I want a short round at the end, though. It's tough beating you sometimes. Oh, I think AA is fine. I don't really want to aid win Kedwin.
What else is bleeding? It's a volunteer. Maybe you AA a volunteer here, weirdly enough. Doesn't trigger that, fortunately. But you do that because it gets it out of your deck. Um, while setting you up for plenty of points. Form the cues while they're playing. Well, they used to beat us because we didn't have interaction, but Tech did a bunch of stuff to deal with this kind of stuff. I would love for them to play Alchemist here. It'd make me very pleased. No. Uh, we just pass here. I don't really know why they're still playing. I don't think you can get out of this, even with like a million points going your way. Our hand's insane. We can literally, we don't even need the Yurden if we don't want to. Like we're going plus six a turn right now. Yeah. Add command me, Queen of Norp inspires us all. There you go. Being of the Queen of the North, eh? Oh man, if I had Maxi, it'd be really useful. I would like a Maxi. Um, so I think the actual correct play here is you go AA for a Cadewind here. I know it looks a little weird. Uh, but it has one big benefit. There's no way for them to get 12 points in one card here. So they either have to start smacking Imprisonment, or they go minus one here. And give us a double last save with Yurden and on Seus. So, this one really sets them up to be in a tough spot. You can run, you can hide, but I'm gonna get you. Yeah, so now they have to sit here and be like, oh god. Alright. That's five four or that's uh yeah, that's enough obviously. I like this. This is becoming sexier and sexier. It's a cool idea. So we pass on on seven. They give we get double last say. MC's fine. I got what I came for. Let's enjoy ourselves. Shall we? I mean, my deck is clogged. But double last say if you're an Sayus. I just, our hands insane. Like, despite all the clogging, we still managed to scrounge up a great hand. Let's let's punish them. Oh, actually, I really like that card. It beats a, bet, a lot better than a lot of stuff in our deck. Huh. Okay. That's a hand, right? Actually, back row is probably... Nah, front row is cracks the truss. Onward, onward, Don't sure worry, you're going to hate me in about four seconds. Going. Destroy, direct, uh, direct, destroy card, conditional cards. Like, wait, what do you mean? Uh, I went better HS. Like, a card just says banish or destroy. Like, the damage is how they interact. But they already have, like, uh... DOC. I mean, Heatwave is banished direct. Like, is that what you're talking about? By the way, Gwent, good to see you here. Miss J hates Maxi. I don't know why. I don't know why, but that's all right. I hate Scoriatel, and she forgives me, so I forgive her for hating Maxi, even though she's wrong on both accounts. Maxi is great, and Scoriatel is vermin. Oh, yeah, big fan of this. This feels great. Your life is worth a great deal, my lord. I come to that. I don't think you're gonna have nine damage, but we're getting more joining me Troys on the deck. It actually kind of helps them out a lot, Loki. I'll get some extra points on the mentors later. So I'm excited to see what unit you're gonna get here. Oh no. All right, well. Pulse. First pulse is achieved. Two more pulses to go. Destroy target creature. I mean, they have that in the game of Epidemic, but nothing good. That's true. Sounds like you agree to disagree then, John. That's a correct, Mr. J. Mr. J, we do indeed. Indeed agree to disagree. 
This poor Colgrim imprisonment player is sitting here and saying like, why, why God, why have you forsaken me? Why am I currently against? Yeah, they're like, no, I need to get through. I can't let it pulse again. Please, no, no. Early on the season, uh, Skellige best, and then rest is a toss up right now. I think that's probably the fairest way to say it. I wish it could be like more than that, but I, I don't. I don't know if it's uh, ultimately how it's all gonna like kind of pan out. It is shaping up though. I'm a firm believer right now Skellig is insane. Personally. And I might be in a minority there. Uh, if I was gonna take a guess, Goyatel seems pretty strong. Uh, I, I, it's so funny. I get the, the ladder and I just don't see the decks I think I'm gonna see. It's kind of like the thing that makes, keeps making me hesitate a little bit. Colgram, come out, come out, wherever you are. Strike fast, leave it no chance to get. I am so excited to see how I get out of this one. Pulse, don't even need Gyarden. Pulse just carried that round one. Ah, oh, man, the rest of the other factions, I don't know. The work, buddy. Just so one sided. I mean, you don't need yard, and we just win. We win on, like, they can play whatever the card is. We win plus two. Jeez. Gosh darn it. I always brick on these two. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, our hand's garbage. I bricked on both of them? I didn't even let that happen, John. Ah! I kinda like that play. Creative. Every gold is 10, so you only get out 9, Sierra. Can this hand really get even... I don't even know how to make this hand worse. See a bunch of bronzes, your mind plays tricks on you. Indeed, Roland. 1099, good to see you here, and yep. My mind was like, why is this my hand? And here we are. I need to play on seven and pass. Okay, that changes a lot of things very quickly, but like, I'll work with that. I'm not proud of how this game went. It, it just happened. I don't, I don't understand. Brittany, how's it going? And by the way, thank you for pulling that out. That's a good point. It's a good point. I like that idea. Let's see. Tomorrow my mission test for college. Oh, Roland, it sounds exciting and terrifying. Good luck, good luck. I know you'll do great. Okay, we mulligan here. We draw all of our bronzes, of course. Now we have a hand. Honestly, I think this is like a pretty easy turn, no matter what way I look at it. You discard. I probably discard Bone Talisman here. We already have Meave. Badman, I'll hook you up right afterwards. I'm not sure you want it yet, though. Are you really sure you want this? Is 
So by discarding, I'm preventing him from clogging of just about anything. And then it keeps the top of our deck very clear. There's Cynthia. It's the only real clog card that works without interacting with my cards. So by just discarding. Actually, is discarding me necessary, John? Yeah, discarding is correct. Because you want to thin your deck out. You want to draw as many cards as possible. So now, now like, this is a fine play. It's like, I'm going to play another card, but our deck size is not going to be that different. Yeah, that's a good play on his part. So he gets two infiltrators in there. Oh, no, again, lost an engine. Okay. There we go. How's it going, bad man? Good to see you here. Piv Master sneaking in here. How's it going? How's it going? Ah, oh, so many wonderful people here today. Love it, love it, love it. No. Are we done banning it now? Maybe you. Wow, okay. He have by command to spam? Yeah. Been doing that with Talisman. Been a lot of teching against Swarm out there right now. Don Street, I'm finding the same problem. If Nilfgaard control starts like these imprisonment decks keep being more popular, I think I'm gonna have to just accept that this might not be a fruitful endeavor. But I think it's worth trying if that makes sense. All I know is my mind's screaming front row, best row. Let's keep going. Let's see. Music marries cultures, connects folk to one another. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, so now you infinitely pulse, right? Yeah, okay, let's get the pulsing going. We will never bow to the invader. Alright, so if you have COC, I'll eat it, but let's get things going. I mean, I think this is fine. As long as you have Prince of Saints, feel pretty okay. Your life is worth a great deal, my lord. Take comfort in that. No COC. That's perfect. Now I'd be getting worried if I were them. Yeah. Do they have any? They don't. Have, they shouldn't have a way to deal eight damage. I can just shove. I think we wait for the last to be the last bleed to subside, and then we go to town. We'll space out. End turn. First pulse off. All right. The next round again. Hey guys, guess what? Here we are, making it work. Okay, they're gonna kill it. Finally. Or steal it. Okay, that's fine. It's like not a big deal. Cause I'm gonna just grab it out of the deck again. All right, solid it back. Yep, you guys are in the right. We got the right mindset going there. So now, now I'd be really worried. Is it kind of working, which feels very good for the record. All right, frigate. Go. I mean, honestly, I might just give the the armor. Make sure you can't do anything to that. This is a beautiful thing, guys. Beautiful thing. Let's get things going. Oh, right? This is so satisfying. Amnesty? Okay, now they're like, okay, I'll just take whatever I can get. Just give me something, please, please. 
I'm like, no. I'll give you nothing. So it, it pops, pops at the end of this turn, so all you do is you go, um... Dun Manor. I think you have Dun Manor back row here? No, it's gotta be Dun Manor front row. Aye, aye, sir. So now it pulses. You come out. Next. We got one more shot here. The Colgram's not what they want to see here, but I actually don't have a way to get the Colgram. But I don't know if Colgram spawning is going to be enough by the end of this, to be honest. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Maybe I just go like this. Nice mess you've got here. I'm gonna have to like kill it fine if not, it's good. I won there. I don't know if we're gonna I don't know if we'll win this one. It'll be close though. We've done a nice job. I think the important part is unlike their points, we're like 10, 10, 10. Everything's pulsing at a pretty fast pace. Strike fast. Leave it no chance to get. I should keep you back. I should keep you back as long as possible. I exist because Master Gehenna wills it so. So beautiful, guys. So we're going to get double 18 point bone talismans in a moment. So I've been waiting for this so I can go on Seiya's shield it slaughter this Witcher. Strike first and strike hard. God, a duel to a duel, I challenge thee. And there's one. We have Bone Talisman in hand for round two. There we go. There we go. We just won a Queen Meave. Let's go. I think the pass at seven is becoming more and more of a way to beat Norman Realms. It's like consistently the right play. There we go. I always regret swarming the front row, so we're just gonna start by default swarming back row. Yeah. Ah. Keep things popping, guys. Mm mm mm. -mm. Our, our Resident Evil Village, really good game. Unbelievable graphics on PS4, it's awesome. Glad you're having a good time, my friend. So we can Queen Meave our way out of this round, which may be where I want to take it. Got to the Meg Mutant time, excellent. I think this is just an unbelievably obnoxious play. It says, yeah, in your hand, do you happen to have a solution or do you just lose uneven? Heat wave or bust, baby. I want to play stockpile. SK, or SVKBW. Why? Why would you ever want that? I do not tech a PRFI for the record. Maybe I, I need to tech a Peller. Well, darn it. They've had lock in hand. Well, I don't have a solution to that, so we'll just keep chugging, eh? No crazy solution in deck? Nope. <laughs> Finally, a real in our list. Yeah, we're trying, we're trying to make this work. But SK, VK, BW, why would you ever want to do that to yourself? I mean, you need charge cards to make it really worth it these days. Um, That strikes me as surprisingly killable. I don't think we have to rush it, though. Soldier, so reinforcement. I think it's correct. Let me just go like this. Go ahead and get restarted again. Put you here. Go. That felt good. 
All right, give me a second. I actually really have to blow my nose. It's like half blowing isn't working. One sec, mute the mic. Also, Zukov, good to see you here, my friend. I saw you sneaking in the chat. Just wanted to call you out real fast. Uh, let's see. Not without good reason. We can be very slow here. If they play, we smack down uh, Cade one night and make this miserable. They want all time stock by his OG Broken Vi. Nice, this gone. Power to the people that like that deck. I'm playing that that uh type of uh crew. Oh kid my knight so much. I hate not running it in deck. Alright. We're going plus two return. Let's get things popping. You seen the Castlevania? Oh, if you spoil anything, I'm gonna kill you, Android Subculture. Uh and by that I mean I uh, know I haven't gotten around to it quite yet. Uh, I forgot it's out. Hold on, let me write that down. I didn't watch it last night. I knew it was coming out Thursday, but it slipped my mind. Cause I, I, I think I posted about it too. Uh, season four is out. Oh, I can't wait. Or no, season three. I think season three. But the new season's out, and that's what matters here, in my opinion. I am uh... So I mean, I could put down poor infantry. I think you put poor infantry. How many spots? They only have two spots left. This is a four-point play if I do it. Nah, it's not good enough. I can play it. Nah, I just. Go for the easy one, John. Let's make their lives a little more painful. Yeah, it's a bone talisman, bud. No, don't don't spoil it, Android subculture. I'm glad you're here, though. Uh, you said, oh, you're the one that's been just beat a drog Erlen deck with the rear round Yurden. Very nice. Yeah, welcome to the game. Welcome to the game. Feel a little bad for them all of a sudden. Putting them down. Putting them down. That's all we can do here, guys. That's all we're going to do here. Yay. I mean, you're you're bad. I mean, honestly, long round with Foltis would win us that. But I can't guarantee we'll get a long round with Foltis. We know they're Thrive. I'm leaning to bleeding aggressively here. And see if I can win off of that. But that's why I'm the way I'm gonna play it. Talk about me, okay. We control the extra meta all the time. Yep, that's true. Let's see. Outer Space Doggo, fast question. Is non Devo worth it in Syndicate? Or the only real counter against Syndicate is Tin Boy, but the high coin cost. I mean, I think you're asking the wrong question. Where I think the question, the question on my mind when I'm thinking about that is, um, not devotion versus non devotion. It's a question of is what what is what is syndicate worth it? Um, is syndicate worth it? Kind of period. Like right now, syndicate. I don't see a syndicate deck that's been popping off that I like. Professor is now very strong, but Orson Junior is fine uh, as devotion. But like syndicate devotion payoff has always been firesworn related, so I'm not big on devotion or syndicate unless I'm going firesworn, uh, because our old rich copying fall knight is the best devotion play you can do. But right now the real question in the meta is: Is there a syndicate deck worth playing? Period. The line pockets got nerfed. Syndicate got a small buff to bounty, but bounty doesn't have bounty's that weird deck when it works, it feels like the greatest thing ever, and when it doesn't work, it feels like nothing short of garbage. So that that for me that's the question on my mind. We're gonna let that guy die. Alert, we wanna keep playing. We want this round to be rough for them if we can. Maybe maybe Radiv Radovids was correct play, that was incorrect play. Okay. Then again it has my it has the least fun echo card. It's a good echo card though. It's plus three and a bone talisman. Pretty strong. But I think I think the question is, will Syndicate really have a deck? Bounty, I don't know if it's there yet. Hopefully in uh, Price of Power, they'll get a couple more tools. They've been buffing Bounty, right? Professor is now very, very good. Uh, Kurt is pretty strong. But the other tools of Bounty are eh, a little painful. 
All right, so I'm a big believer in whatever just happened there. Big believer. Whatever that was. If the king demands a head, I'll give him yours. Hey, all proud cow. How's it going? How's it going? Stream goes well. Thank you. Stream's going well, especially now that you're here, my friend. How are you? I think you don't kill this immediately in case you have Osiril. I think you just go like, well, maybe I do. Now let's go like this. Good. Just spend time with dad at the moment. That's nice. That's nice. I like it. Line pocket seems strong, especially horse and junior professor. Maybe I, I mean line pocket. The thing that makes line pro or pocket strong is that the bronze crimes is uh, your shakedowns, your dip of the pop stars are legitimately insane cards. If I hit you, you hit back, so let's just like make sure this thing lives. I just can't imagine what you I think it's gotta be Heatwave or something that kills tall because they no, it wasn't they used Heatwave on nothing. Whatever, find your 18 points, please. GG. You go back. I do want to keep Peller in case. Probably you or you. Oh, actually, I actually have Radovids. Too many Radovids. Eh. I have a prince in hand. I'll put back a uh, sergeant. Nice. Let's see. It warns my soul that Lippy has the power. Uh, that Blippy has been power crept. I know, right? Feels good. Peller for defender. Uh, Peller is going to be good for just anything. I don't think they're going to be defender. I think it's going to be a ball deck. If my gut tells me. If my gut speaks truth. We're going to be fighting ball. No need to rush out anything here. We have a very strong hand. So I feel pretty okay with it. It always looks bad every time I look at it, but like, no, nope, this hand's fine, John. Chill out. Sergeant's when they're good when they put uh, Spy next to Foltis. First lock is down. It's fine. Fall overboard and I'm not jumping in after you. Climbing of Meave. Do you remember playing for begging me for Meave on patch today? Maybe. I don't know. Everyone begs for a lot of things. Bubble Trump. I've had people ask me for decks for never multiple weeks and trying to say, John, when are you playing it? I'm like, I'm trying. I'm trying. Please be gentle. Self-clogging coming. I don't think it's going to be anything too fancy. You're going to be good to see you here. This is looking like a bald, uh, quad wet without... Ball or a ball with bronze aristocrats. Here we go. Now we get to find out. Yeah, there we go. There's the what. Lost spirit devoid of name, but now available. MVP Bella, indeed. I don't know a way to truly remove it though. But like, you can see them pausing really quickly, like, huh. About that play of yours. Game is not balanced, but it's seeming fun. Yeah, that's what a single player card game should feel like. The moment, yeah, like you want to have moments where you just go off. I enjoyed playing that. Deck needs Curse Knight. Nah, I'm not going to tech for the wet. Get. The coup d'etat. Mess it up. That's not what you're looking to do. I know why they're doing that, but... They're doing that just because, like, hey, look how many points they have, right? Aye, aye, sir. Onward. Attack. <laughs> Get him, tiger. Final. So we're going plus four a turn, if they can answer it. Oh yeah, we got an Erlen here. No princess, but like Erlen often drops for ten, like a bunch of points. Because our deck is just units, except for like four spells. Maybe I think you have four spells in the deck, uh, and Erlen. So Erlen, even in round three, is gonna still be hitting for twelve. And if I get him in round one, I can smack him down to take the round of uh, seventeen. So yeah, we're running Erlen. We are an Erlen clicker. 
We click the Erlen. So next round they bleed you dry. Now they're gonna pass in a second. Nope, never mind. Oh, is that greedy? Yeah, I think I was greedy by them. All right, let the fun begin. Now the fun begins. Now we're ahead on points. And so if they lose the round on even, right, we go plus one. Or I'll take their leader from them. And this has got to be stressful. Because the wet's gone, so that's probably the easiest way to make sure you win this round. But that's obviously not going to fly anymore. Poison whenever you want, bud. Big fan of that move on your part. Go ahead and remind them that we can generate a lot of points very quickly if we want to. Kid, when my boy, you're up. Got some bad news for you, fun. Go. They, I doubt you have three poisons in your hand. If you do, I'll eat it there. But, like, it's okay. I don't feel bad. No devotion. Wonder what aristocrats they run? I thought it would be, uh... Well, they might not be. They might just be, like, a wet control deck. Or you're running the Thirsty Dames and the Two Hunters. Yep. How's that feel? I mean, might as well just keep bleeding him, right? Just a more Particular tastes. To slay dragons is our nightly duty. They're not gonna like where this is going. What's the way? Who wrote about that assimilate deck? Any link? I mean, I, I don't know. If, have I done this? I feel like I did an assimilate deck on this patch. Eat buff ties and wins it. I can also just play Earl and then Bun Talisman for the win. I'll let him have a draw if he wants. Yeah, I think I think Uma Fig, I agree with you. I don't think they'll have an answer there, Erlen. I think it's the play here. Hmm. Behold, new gods, iron might. there I think we did all right I'm on defender feels good uh if they bleed you know slap an Erlen down I don't think they're gonna bleed but sitting on Erlen here feels very dirty yum 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 um I'll just keep the hand looks fine do it the amphibious is all for the other infantry if they play or we just play the infantry here sack them to the gods no. Might as well keep this. It was at least gonna be a 13 pointer. And uh with uh Yeah, this is just gonna be a miserable round for them. I appreciate giving them miserable rounds. Now honestly, I might just keep Defender for the wet. Like we know it's coming. No secret. Don't need you. Hand's actually disgusting. Um You three stink. You three are great. Okay, cool. Mmm. Mmm. Warm front row because we have this interest. It's here. AA. Go into our deck. Grab the infantry again. We know we're going to at least bone talisman one time. Or actually, maybe we'll just try that there. That seems like a fine play here. So that means they can duet me and such, but I don't think they can outpoint me. Maybe. Could be wrong. That might have been a mistake. 
But like, at this point, they blew both Fangs and Top Bear. So they should be in trouble. KD and 11. KD and 11. Welcome to the Blaine Duck family. I'm so glad you said to join us here today as we learn all about different types of Chinese card games. Welcome aboard. Go and get in the chat. Meet the people. Say hello to me. I'll say hello to you. I stream six days a week, eight hours per day. Now, Sunday is my day off. So it won't be your Sunday, but it will be your tomorrow. Pretty sweet. On top of all that epicness, there's a YouTube and Discord. So if you like this, you're going to love those. And we're playing around the Twitter and Reddit as well. So if that's your jam, you want to be on the front lines of the experimentation, feel free to pop in there too. I guess we should play here, right? That's the wrong spot, though, by the way. Uh, so if they have trees and they can kill this, which is obviously not what I want to have happen, but let's see. Let's see. Saw a lot of your YouTube videos. Oh, it's wonderful. First time watching you on Twitch. Well, I'm so glad you're here, and I'm glad you're loving the YouTube. That's awesome. Now you get to see all the failures it takes for me to create a great deck, but we've gotten pretty far of this one, so um, might not see too, too many more failures here. Want to do that for the buff. I'm aware we're going to miss out on two points because of that. But, like, I want to do... I, too, discovered John on YouTube. Yeah, I tried to work hard on that. Getting the YouTube going. Okay. The Roderick for Gorfer, I bet. Yep. Yeah. You are so lucky to draw Queen Mew for the record. Because this would be the worst. If I didn't, if I drew Queen Mew and I was close, you would be really sad right now. Monsters. No, a ghost suffice for now. Okay, steal my trust, fine. Is there any way I can just muck about and mess up everything of his? No. No. I will not let this become a second Sodom. So you do want to do this because the last two cards is Cantarell and Coup. So might as well yoink it and hide this uh, the Erland points before I yoink out um, for infantry. Uh, infantry, out you go. You try to win them all, but you won't. And all you're gonna do here is wait. They're gonna play their card. Uh, it's gonna be the wet. You smack down Triss, grab the bone talisman, buff everything, put shield wall on the wet. So that you nuke the, you stop the three points coming off of two. But wait, how are you triggering a masquerade ball then? Weird. Like, you just, did he just net deck? Does he not know? Wait, does he not? Wait, does he not know how ball works now? I shall be your eyes. I just, it just occurred to me, guys. Hold on, hold on, hold your phone. Wait, this is really bad for him. That worked out pretty well for you. Just yep. I do know how your deck works. And now it's probably settling in that he has a problem. Wow. <laughs> oh. They didn't realize the ball got nerfed. There's very specific additional words. Big yikes. Okay. Appreciate the donation of points. Hi, love noob. Welcome, welcome. Good to see you here. Ugh, that hurt. That hurt the watch. That hurt the watch. I mean, we did a good job, but still. That hurt the watch. So I'll be honest, I consider that deck to be pretty mindless. Um. Well, who do I want to sacrifice to the gods? Maybe I try to get through this with just a uh, frigate. On um, back row? Form the back row, John. Uh, some spicier deck? Uh, you're kind of. I'm be creative. Um, I know some people have had some luck with cloggers, as much as they'd say it. SK Witchers? I think I at least I'm a believer that SK Witchers is nuts. And I think people are sleeping on it. I could be totally wrong, but it feels like it's invincible in any control deck, it's invincible in this deck. It's just so many points. It's so vicious and so effective. 
Uh, man, what other decks? Uh, you could try Harmony. Harmony, I don't think is as good as or as like a Witches, though. But maybe I'm the crazy one, guys. I could be. Yeah, you know, that stuff happens. So they're gonna be lippy. I'm just gonna go for the spawn everything I can. Work from there. Ooh, maybe smoke them out was correct, John. Cause now you don't have a soldier. Smoke them out was correct. Whoops. Cause it spawns. He gets stuck. And then he used that. Wow, I made a lot of mistakes there. Man, this deck is hard to pilot. I feel like it might be just my how bad I am at Norman Realms, though, if that makes sense. They haven't committed anything, so I want to be a little cautious. Want to concede, SK, SK Witchers, rocks, but the mirrors are pay, I mean, in the back. Yeah, well, the question is, would you rather a 50-50 mirror? Or would you rather just lose the game immediately because of the SK Witchers? Okay, I know they're going to be annoying, so let's just do this. I don't know. I think, I think SK Witchers is the best. You can try the Northern Rail or the... Okay, perfect. It's fine. Now I can do Dun Banner. And just sacrifice them bandits of the gods so I can keep spawning here. Alert, the arms! I mean, we just can't lose this round. The fact that these how the war, uh, rules work. Simulate. Oh, simulate's pretty good. That's not, not a bad option as well. It's a drummer that took a heat wave. You know what? I'll take it, Gwen. It also casually loads up our deck of a second frigate, or a third frigate, which is not a terrible thing. Um. Wow, that went really well, guys. That went really well. They played nothing, but like then Sears on crate. They must have raked that and or near man. See, it's a bummer. Perfect draws. Okay, I don't. I don't. Literally, don't think I need to draw for my deck. Nah, there's some good stuff there. Let's get a nice long round with uh, everything set up. Hey, Lippy the most. I don't know what to tell you, Outer Space Doggo. What else? Do, what other decks do we have? You can try Harmony, I guess. Maybe Harmony is your jam. I think SK Witches is better, though. You could also try the Imprisonment Shoop deck from yesterday. Or just go Unitless and give up. Unitless does okay, but like people are realizing how strong Unitless is. So they're playing into beatdown decks like, like SK Witcher. You just lose that matchup automatically. Maybe I do Harmony. Harmony or the Nilf card deck from yesterday. Useless, useless. Useless. Wow, these all stink. Uh, you're the worst. You're the second worst. That's a great draw. That's a fine draw. Not getting you as a bummer. Or an Italis, which is in there to make it hit. If you have COC and Heat Wave, I'll cry. But if you only have one Heat Wave, gosh, darn it. How many more of these do we have to go through till I can finally have one of my kings and queens survive? No. I actually don't have a good answer to that, do I? Oh, that's a lie. She lives. Yeah, how's that feel, punk? Yeah, I'll put another one on her. That's fine. Warm the back row, John. That's the rule here. Next. Yeah, no, we killed those. Well, she gets her first proc off. I'll take it. On the triggers, she triggers. First proc is down. Now we get cooking. Do you see it being run a lot? I mean, it's a lippy. That's why I feel like just lippy. Now they're going to try to find, I think, we're near Mancy for Heat Wave here. I don't think they were near. Oh, they did run near Mancy. Okay, never mind. We're good. He's going to keep proccing from here on out. Sweet. This is going very poorly for them, very fast. I'm loving this. 
This also fixes the Peller problem. The Dutch, not enough. Here's the Bear Witcher. Are you going to try to smack through Queen Mew? You might. I don't have a good answer to it either. Nope, you're just trying to minimize the damage. I respect that. I'm going to go ahead and tap top of our deck and cry a little bit, but it is technically an improvement over Peller. This feels really dirty, guys. Do I see a Meave deck? Yeah. You see a Meave deck that's kind of working, which is very scary. Like, the we're down on points, but man, we get a lot of points at the very fast at the end here. Oh. We have one more proc of Meave. I don't have quite the amount of Swarm I'm looking for, but like, honestly, I'll take it. He wait for an Eremancy for Yeet. No, he already, he already Ornir Mancy. Ornir Mancy's right now in his deck. He's digging for it, though. Which I don't blame him for doing. With the rise above, go beyond, become more. I mean, he might be able to Heat Wave his way out of here, but like... Nope, he hasn't found Heat Wave. Hey, listen or CSA. Well. Listen well. So I want to put you there in case it needs to just find COC. Chris. I see strong magic. Get the Bone Talisman. You tank there. You're fine. You can just stay there as you are. And uh, it's found the Stunning Blow. Not going to be enough. Come on, I deserve the three shots of Queen Meave. Okay. Well, G, G. That's brutal. That's actually brutal. Okay, guys, I think we might have our deck list here. The deck that preys on the point slam decks. This is cruel. We got through a heat wave and the COC. Big salt indeed. Like, no. No, I shall not let you finish the game. There will be... No, no, Bone Talisman, Erlen, Bone Talisman in one turn. <laughs> Shoutouts to Ahmed Ali and Pamzasaurus for all the support on Patreon. Thank you all so much.